My family came to San Pedro just after World War II. My father was a lineman for Bill Telephone, and back then, Bill Telephone was a national company. And uh, he was stringing lines in Chicago in about uh, 20 below zero, and came down from the pole and said, I gotta find a warmer place to live. And so he went in and checked in at the, at the headquarters and said, I need to find a place that's warmer. Do you have any op job openings in a warm place? So the, his boss kind of went through the, uh, you know, the, the job openings and so forth and said, well, I have a place, an opening in a place called San Pedro, California. Uh, I don't know where that is, but uh, it, uh, he goes, I don't know where it is either, but it's, it's got to be warmer than here. If it's in California, I'll take it. And so he really didn't even, he had to find San Pedro on the map and say, oh, okay, this is where we're, we're going to move. And he had, uh, working for Bill Telephone, he had done a favor for a local executive with uh, uh, General Motors. I don't know, he put a telephone in for him or something like that, and the guy said, wanted to give him a tip. And he says, well, I'll tell you what, instead of giving me a tip, why don't you sell me the first truck that comes off your, off your uh, assembly line uh, after the war here? And uh, he, he said it jokingly. Sure enough, a couple months later, the guy calls him, says, hey, that first truck's coming off the assembly line. He goes, you, you want it? And uh, I don't know if it was actually the first truck, but it was one of the first. And my dad said, yes, and he went and bought the truck. And so what he did was, is he took my oldest sister, Joyce, uh, and uh, put her in the truck and left my mom and my other sister, Sandy, uh, back in Chicago and uh, got on to Route 66 and started heading to San Pedro. And uh, got here in San Pedro, and as again, it was the first time they'd ever been here. Uh, he went and checked out where his, his new employment was, which was right here on 5th and Pacific. The building is still there. And uh, that was the, the old Pacific, uh, Pacific or Bell Telephone office. And uh, so he thought he'd just drive around town to find uh, maybe a possible place to live. And he was driving up 25th Street, and he sees this guy hammering a for sale sign in front of a house on 25th Street in Walker. And so he pulls over and said, uh, yeah, I, you know, I'm new in town. And this guy was a, just hadn't been a longshoreman. And, and uh, he said, yeah, you know, well, welcome to San Pedro. And he goes, uh, yeah, I see you're selling your house, son. He goes, yeah, I'll put it up for sale. He goes, well, he goes, I don't have much money, but, uh, you know, how much do you want for it? And the guy goes, I really like that truck. And uh, so he said, well, can we make a deal? And so my dad gave the truck as a down payment and, bought the house and uh, that's where we where I grew up or actually where I was born I was born shortly after that in the old brick uh, uh, hospital <laughs>